Hey guys, it's Lotus and welcome back to another video. Uh, again, because I enjoy the simulator so much, I will be doing another one, the Hunger Games Simulator, featuring the cast from Omniscient Reader's Viewpoint. Uh, so recently, I've actually started reading the novel from where I last left off. I'm like in, I'm like 400 chapters in where I, I last stopped. So I'm actually like 100 or so chapters um, close to the end. Uh, so I really wanted to just uh, revisit the characters and try to remember uh, who they were and their attributes and everything since it has been a while since I uh, last read the book. Uh, and so I thought it'd be really fun to also do a Hunger Games simulator because uh, ORV does take place in an apocalypse where everyone has to fight to survive. Okay, so let me just uh, ex uh, introduce all of the characters um, from, the, from the beginning. Okay, so District 1 is Kim Dok Ja, our protagonist, and Yoo Jong Hyuk, who is the main character of Ways of Survival, and also Kim Dok Ja's uh, life and death companion. <laughs> Um, District 2 is Lee Gil, -yong, Lee Gil Yong and Shin Yu Sung, who are Kim Dok Ja's um, surrogate kids, pretty much. District 3 is Han Soo Yong, who is the author of Ways of Survival, and Yu Sung Ah, who is Kim Dok Ja's co worker. District 4 is Lee Sol Lee Sol Hua, I am so sorry for my pronunciation. <laughs> Lee Sol Hua, who was uh, Yu Jong Hyuk's wife in previous regressions, and she's also a doctor. Um, and Han Myung Oh, which was uh, Kim Dok Ja's superior at Minosoft. Uh, District 5 is Lee Hyun Sung, a sh soldier. And Jung Hae Wan, which was a person who Kim Dok Ja had saved who wasn't in the original Ways of Survival. Uh, District 6 is Kim Nam Moon, um, who, because uh, Kim Dok Ja interfered uh, and ended up uh, in Ways of Survival, uh, he ended up dying. Um, when he was supposed to live, but don't worry, we see Kim Nam Moon again later on, uh, later on in the book, so, uh, he makes an appearance, so even though he's dead, he's not really <clears throat> dead, you know what I mean? Uh, and also Lee Ji Hae, who is, um, a high school student, I believe, and she, uh, was part of Yoo Jong Hyuk's original team from the book. Um, District 7 is Yoo Mia, which is Yoo Jong Hyuk's younger sister, and Bi Hyung, who is the Dokebi in charge of Kim Dok Ja's channel. Uh, District 8 is Uriel, uh, the Archangel, and the Abyssal Black Flame Dragon, who is one of the constellations, um, who is also, he was originally Kim Nam Moon's uh, sponsor, but after uh, Kim Dok Ja interfered with the plot, he became uh, Han Soo Young's sponsor. Okay, District 9 is Gong Pil Du. Uh, he's a cannon fodder, pretty much. Uh, Anna Croft, who is like a prophet. Um, District 10 is Zhang Haiyong, um, which was a character that Kim Bok Ja actually begged the author to include uh, in the Ways of Survival. And um, Sun Wukong, which is the great sage equal of heaven, who is also a constellation. Uh, District 11 is Hades and Persephone, who are constellations and also Kim Dok Ja's adopted parents. They just saw him and were like, you're our kid now. <laughs> Which I think is hilarious and so wholesome. And finally, District 12 is the secret of Plotter and the oldest dream. Now, spoiler, I mean, this whole video will be spoilers, but spoiler, um, especially if you haven't read the novel and you don't want to know who they are, then uh, don't listen to what I'm about to say, but um, secret of Plotter is Yu Jong Hyuk from the original Ways of Survival, who became an outer god and wants to reach the end and watch Kim Dok Ja reach the end of this world. Yeah. Um, I think he's the 1863rd round. That was the end of um, the original Ways of Survival, and that's the round that he is. And the oldest dream, who is, <laughs> spoiler alert again, um, actually Kim Dok Ja. And he is Yoo Jong Hyuk's sponsor. Now, I actually, again, I have not read the entire novel. I have a hundred or so chapters left, but um, I have seen spoilers online, so I do know his identity. As for the explanation behind how he, how Kim Dok Ja ended up being the oldest dream, I still don't know the details yet, and I will get to it soon once I uh, catch up to that chapter. Yeah, so those are all our contestants for the Hunger Games. Uh, may the odds ever be in their favor. So let's proceed. Hopefully, everything goes well. Okay, the bloodbath. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Bi Hyung grabs a shield leaning on the cornucopia. 
Kim Dok Ja runs away from the cornucopia. Don't abandon your companions, Kim Dok Ja. Uh, Persephone, ooh, Persephone runs away from the cornucopia. Sun Wukong runs away from the cornucopia. The oldest dream takes a sickle from inside the cornucopia. Gong Pil Du repeatedly stabs Lee Gil Yong to death with Saiz? <gasps> Gil Yong, oh my god, how could you? Uh, Zhang Haiyong runs away with a lighter and some rope. Hades finds a bag full of explosives. Lee Sol Hua snatches a bag of alcohol in a rag. Now, as a doctor, I have full confidence she knows what to do with that alcohol in rag. Uh, Lee Hyun Sung scares Lee Ji Hae away from the cornucopia. <laughs> No, Hyun Sung is actually a big old teddy bear. He's he, I, although I guess that picture is kind of uh, scary, but yeah. Yu Mia rips the mace out of Secret of Plotter's hands. Oh, her to her own brother. Oh my gosh, ruthless siblings, huh? Uh, Jung Hae Won finds a backpack full of camping equipment. Anna Croft runs away from the cornucopia. Shin Yu Sung finds a bow, some arrows, and a quiver. Han Su Yong, Yu Jung Hyuk. The Abyssal Black Flame Dragon and Kim Namun share everything they gathered before running. Okay. Oh yeah, some of the words are cut off. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, let me see. Can I? Ooh. Let me let me just move this so that everyone can see the words better. I didn't realize that uh it was getting cut off. Uh, let me just move. There we go. That should be good. Okay, uh, Han Su Yung, Yu Jung Hyuk, Black Flame, Black Flame Dragon, and Kim Na Moon share everything they gathered before running. Okay, teamwork, yeah. Yuriel finds a canteen full of water. That's good. You're gonna need to stay hydrated for this. Han Myung Oh runs away from the cornucopia, and Yu Sung Ah runs away from the cornucopia. We have one casualty already. Poor Lee Kyung Ah, Lee Kyung Ah. Okay, day one. The Abyssal Black Flame Dragon searches for a water source. Now, Yuriel has water, so he might have to uh, <clears throat> ask her for some. Lee Sol Hua tries to sleep through the entire day. Okay, saving her energy. Hades goes hunting. Anna Croft tends to Persephone's wounds. Oh, okay, that's nice. Han Myung Oh tries to spear fish with the trident. Uh, good luck with that. Yu Mia sprains her ankle while running away from Kim Dok Ja. All I'm imagining right now is the meme, like, why are you running? Because Kim Dong Ja would literally be like, why are you running? Like, don't run away from me, I'm your brother's companion. Han Su Yong begs for Shin Yu Song to kill her. She refuses, keeping Han Su Yong alive. Good. The author can't die here. Um, Yuriel steals from Gong Pil Du while he isn't looking. <laughs> deserved. Honestly, deserved. After what he did to Gil Yong, deserved. Yu Jung Hyuk practices, practices his archery. I bet he's really good at it, as as he is, you know, good at everything. Uh, Yu Sang Ah and Kim Nam Moon hunt for other tributes. Uh, Zhang Ha Yong receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Ooh, uh, which constellation is sponsoring Zhang Ha Yong? <laughs> uh, Secret of Plotter attacks Lee Hyun Sung, but he manages to escape. Oh no! Oh no! You were comrades in the previous regressions. How could you? The oldest dream scares Bi Hyung off. <laughs> the oldest dream couldn't hurt a fly. I can't imagine. Bi Hyung is just a whim. Okay, Lee Ji Hae and Jung Hae Won work together for the day. Okay, good. Pairing up. And Sun Wukong collects fruit from a tree. Yes, our great sage, the eagle of heaven, lounging in a tree, just enjoying his fruits. Okay. Fallen Tributes 1. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance. Lee Gil Yong, District 2. Oh, Gil Yong ah. We'll avenge you! We will avenge you! Gong Pil Du is going down now. Okay, night one. Han Su Yong defeats Yu Sang Ah in a fight, but spares her life. Oh, okay, thank goodness. Okay. Uh, wait, where, aren't they also in the, from the same district? Wait, okay. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon defeats Persephone in a fight, but spares her life. Okay, constellations stick together. Uh, Yu Jung Hyuk, Lee Hyun Sung, and Jung Hae Wan successfully ambush and kill. Han Myung Oh, Yu Mia, and Kim Dok Ja. Oh my god, the protagonist. Kim Dok Ja is out. He didn't even last through the first night. Oh my god. Or, yeah, this is the first night. Yu Jung Hyuk killed his own sister. Han Myung Oh, I don't really care about. But oh my god, Kim Dok Ja, Yu Mia. <laughs> Gong Pil Du receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Ill. Okay. 
Zhang Haiyong tries to sing herself to sleep. Yeah, oh. Uh, Lee Sul Hua receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Bi Hyung stays awake all night. <laughs> He's really tiny. He doesn't have that much power, so, you know, he has to stay up and protect himself. Yuriel, Lee Ji Hei, Shin, Yong, Shin Yu Song, and Haiti sleep in shifts. Okay. Uh, Sun Wukong catches Secret of Platter off guard and kills him. <gasps> not the Secret of Platter! You did- okay. You did not go through 1,863 regression rounds to be killed by the Great Sage Equal of Heaven. Okay, that just- no. Uh, Oldest Dream quietly hums. Okay, really in character. Kim Na Moon quietly hums. Not in character. Anna Croft climbs a tree to rest. Okay, she also has a good vantage point by being uh, on a tree. Okay. Day two. The Abyssal Black Flame Dragon receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Oh, so he finally he finally got the water he was looking for. Oldest Dream and Lee Ji Hei work together for the day. Aww. Uh, Jung Hae Wan travels to higher ground. Lee So Hua constructs a shack. Lee Hyun Sung chases Shin Hyu Sung. No, stop! Don't scare her! She's just the elementary school kid. Uh, Han Su Yong steals from Hades while he isn't looking. Oof, big oof. <laughs> Persephone, Yu Jung Hyuk, and Anna Croft track down and kill Bi Hyung. <laughs> They're like death to the Dokebis. I mean, understandable, but poor Bi Hyung, look how cute he is. Look at his dirt face. Uh, Yu Sung Ah constructs a shack. Sun Wukong sprains his ankle while running away from Zhang Haya. <laughs> Uh, Gong Pil Du makes a wooden spear. Kim Na Moon searches for firewood. Yuriel receives an explosion from an unknown sponsor. Ooh, who could it be? I feel like it would have been from Metatron, you know, or Michael, the Archangel. Okay, so Fallen Tributes 2. Five cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Han Myung Oh, Yu Mia, Kim Dok Ja, Secret of Plotter. Be him. Oh my gosh, all of the uh, ma a lot of the main contenders were killed off right at the off the bat. I mean Kim Buck Jaw is always dying, so I'm not surprised, but I don't think you can resurrect here in the Hunger Games. Secret of Plotter, I'm so disappointed in you. Okay. Night two. Sun Wu Are you kidding me? Sun Wukong falls into a pit and dies. So he succeeded in taking down the outer god, Secret of Plotter, and then he dies by falling into a pit. Sun Wukong, what are you doing? You're the great sage equal of heaven. <laughs> okay. Now it's anyone's game. All of the all of the strong players are dying off like flies. Yu Sung Ah and Lee Jae Hae fight Hades and Kim Na Moon. Hades and Kim Na Moon survive. <gasps> Yu Sung Ah and Lee Jae Hae both perish. Oh no. Persephone begs for Oldest Dream to kill her. He refuses, keeping Perse Persephone alive. Oh, okay. Abysmal Black Flame Dragon goes to sleep. Zhang Haiyong, Gong Pil Du, Li Hyun Sung, and Jung Hae Wan sleep in shifts. Han Su Yung, Shin Yu Sung, Yu Jung Hyuk, and Li Sol Hua sleep in shifts. Okay. Yuriel tends to Anna Cross wounds. <sighs> Where's this going? Okay, day three. Jung Hae Wan and Zhang Haiyong split up to search for resources. Okay. Shin Yu Sung receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Oh, is even though Kim Dok Ja is out of the game as an incarnation, maybe. He's, you know, he's now just doing his job as Shin Yu Sung's uh, sponsor, so he's gonna watch over her uh, uh, from the stars, you know? Uh, Lee Hyun Sung searches for a water source. The Abyssal Black Flame Dragon strangles Hades with a rope. <gasps> Ruthless. Han Su Young camouflages herself in the bushes. Kim Nam Won, Yu Jung Hyuk, Oldest Dream and Yuriel, and Gong Pil Du hunt for other tributes. Lee Sol Hua constructs, uh, constructs another shack. She's been constructing a lot of shacks, you know. Persephone tends to Anna Croft's wounds. Okay, Anna Croft is getting tended to by a lot of people. Okay. Arena event. A monstrous hurricane wrecks havoc on the arena. Oh no. Yu Joo Hyuk survives. Phew. Han Su Yung survives. Phew. Kim Na Moon is struck in the hurricane. Oh no. Jung Hae-won survives, Anna Croft survives, Abyssal Black Flame Dragon survives, Lee Seo Lee Seo Lee Seo Hua survives, Yuro survives, Jung Hae-won ha survives. Oh my god! Shin Yu Sung is inca incapacitated by flying debris and dies! Gong Pil Du pushes Persephone into an incoming boulder. 
Okay, yeah, I am done with this guy. I am done with Golden Peel Dew. He better not win. I'm gonna be so angry. Oh, this dream survives. Oh, our baby. Oh no, Lee Hyun Sung is sucked into the hurricane. All of the strongest players are dying. Fallen Tributes 3. Eight cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Sun Wukong, Yu Sang Ah, Lee Ji Hei, Hades, Kim Na Moon, Shin Yu Song, Persephone, and Lee Hyun Sung. Night 3. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon dies from thirst. Yo, didn't you just get water? Oh my god, how did you die from thirst? Yuriel receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Yu Jung Hyuk severely slices oldest dream with the sword. He killed his own sponsor. The person which is the reason for your existence. You killed him. Uh, Lee, oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, this is serious. Lee Sol Hua, Anna Croft, and Zhang Haiyong get into a fight. Anna Croft triumphantly kills them both. Oh no. Gong Pil Du receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. I am so done with you. You better not win. Jung Hae Won receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor, and Han Soo Young attempts to start a fire but is unsuccessful. Rip, rip to our author. She could have used uh, the pages of her unfinished novel to light a campfire. You know, that's that's what you can do. With you're not gonna need to write any novels in the apocalypse. You better use your books for a uh, Kindle. You know, the feast. The cornucopia is replenished with food supplies, weapons, and memoirs from the tribute's families. Han Soo Young decides not to go to the feast. Yu Jung Hyuk decides not to go to the feast. Gong Pil Du decides not to go to the feast. Jung Hae Won decides not to go to the feast. Anna Croft decides not to go to the feast. <gasps> Yuriel falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Oh my gosh. You're a heavenly being. How did you drown in a lake? Okay. Okay, honestly, Yu Jung Hyuk better <laughs> Yu Jung Hyuk better win this. That would be so embarrassing for the protagonist if he doesn't. Okay. <clears throat> Day four. <coughs> oh, sorry. Anna Croft searches for a water source. Gong Pil Du runs away from Yu Jung Ho. Yeah, you better run. Han Su Young steals from Jung Hae Won while she isn't looking. <laughs> I mean, in character, that's kind of what she does. Okay, Fallen Tributes 4. Five cannon shots can be heard in the distance. The Abyssal Black Flame Dragon. Oldest Stream. Oh, our poor baby. Lee So Hua. Zhang Haiyong. And Uriel. There are only a few people left, right? Okay. Night 4. Jung Hae Won cooks her food before putting her fire out. Gong Pil- Oh my god. I am- No. No. Uh-uh. Gong Pil Du, Han Soo Young, and Anna Croft get into a fight. Gong Pil Du triumphantly kills them both. <gasps> Yu Jung Hyuk starts a fire. No. Uh-uh. 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 No. Uh-uh. No. Gong Pil Du better not- Better not win this Hunger Games. I'm gonna be so mad. Day 5. Jung Hae Won and Yu Jung Hyuk work together for a day. Yeah, work together. Take down Gong Pil Du. Gong Pil Du makes a slingshot. Fallen Tributes 5. Two cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Han Su Young and Anna Croft. Our strong ladies! Okay. Night 5. Gong Pil Du tries to treat his infection. Oh, he better succumb to it. Yu Jung Hyuk starts a fire. Jung Hae Won thinks about winning. Yeah, yeah, think about the future. <laughs> okay. I'm not mad. <clears throat> I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Day 6. Yu Jung Hyuk falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Mm hmm. Okay. Gong Pil Du kills Jung Hae Won while she is resting. <sighs> what a sneak. Fallen Tribute 6. Two cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Yu Jung Hyuk and Jung Hae Won. The winner... Oh my god, I can't believe I'm saying this. The winner is Gong Pil Du from District 9. I want to recount. I want to recount. No. Uh-uh. I am so, No. <sighs> okay. This is, our, this is our placement. Gong Pil Du is the winner. Followed by Jung Hae Won in second place. And then Yu Jung Hyuk in third place. And then everyone else is kind of just like, eh, you know? Oh my gosh. Okay. I am so disappointed. Here is a summary. Okay, the bloodbath. Uh, Gong Pil Du repeatedly stabs Lee Gil Yong to death with Saiyas. He, uh, he did the first kill, too. Day one, no deaths occurred. 
Night 1, Yoo Jung Hyuk, Lee Hyun Sung, and Jung Hae Won successfully ambush and kill Han Myung Oh, Yoo Mia, and Kim Dok Ja. Sun Wukong catches Secret of Plotter off guard and kills him. Day 2, Persephone, Yoo Jung Hyuk, and Anna Croft track down and kill Bi Hyung. Night 2, Sun Wukong dies, it falls into a pit and dies. Yoo Sung Ah and Lee Ji Hae fights Hades and Kim Nam Moon. Hades and Kim Nam Moon survive. Day 3, Abyssal Black Flame Dragon strangles Hades with a rope. Arena event. A monstrous hurricane wrecks havoc on the arena. Kim Nam Moon is sucked into the hurricane. Shin Yu Sung is incapacitated by flying debris and dies. Gong Pil Du pushes Persanifo Persanifon. Persephone, I'm so sorry. I accidentally pronounce Persephone's persona phone sometimes because I look at it and I see phone. It's Persephone. I looked it up the pronunciation. I'm so sorry. Gopil Du pushes Persephone into an incoming boulder. Lee Hyun Sung is sucked into the hurricane. Wow, that took out a lot of people. Night 3. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon dies from thirst. Yu Jong Hyuk severely slices Oldest Dream with a sword. Lee Sol Hua, Anna Croft, and Jang Ha Young gets into a fight. Anna Croft triumphantly kills them both. The feast. Uriel falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Day 4. No deaths occurred. Night 4. Gong Pil Du, Han Su Young, and Anna Croft get into a fight. Gong Pil Du triumphantly kills them both. Day 5. No deaths occurred. Night 5. No deaths occurred. Day 6. Yu Jong Hyuk falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Our protagonist, everyone. Round of applause. <sighs> Gong Pil Du kills Jung Hae Won while she is resting. A sneak attack. How cowardly. And the winner is Gong Pil Du from District 9. Yay! Ugh. Here are the statistical placements. Uh, Gong Pil Du is first place, and in last place is Lee Gil Yong because he was murdered in cold blood by Gong Pil Du before the day even started. Uh, District placements, District 9 uh, came out in first because Gong Pil Du was part of it, and District 7 came in last. Uh, kills, Gong Pil Du, Yu Jong Hyuk. Um, have are tied in first place with five kills and uh, at the bottom with one kill each is the abyssal black flame dragon persephone and sun wukong okay 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 um am i mad yeah uh what am i gonna do about it i'm gonna do the simulator one more time we're gonna do it again and we are gonna hope that he does not win this time i am so angry right now he better not win again Come on, Kim Dok Ja, Yu Jong Hyuk, Secret of Plot, you gotta step it up. You guys are like the big bosses. How could you die toward the beginning of the game? I'm so disappointed in you guys. Okay. Okay. Let's do this again one more time. I'm gonna do it one more time. Okay? Uh, let's start. Let's start. Okay, the bloodbath. Um, as the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Bi Hyung grabs a shield leaning leaning on the cornucopia. Kim Dok Ja runs away from the cornucopia. Uh, Perse Persephone runs away from the cornucopia. Sun Wukong runs away from the cornucopia. The oldest- wait, is this the same thing? Wait, how do I- it's the same story. How do I, um... How can I re- re- Maybe I edit- how would I- Oh yeah, so this is how you fill it out, by the way, if you want to make your own. You would, uh, type in the character's name, you would find an image on the internet, and put in the URL for the image, you choose their gender. Uh, and then you can also choose, um, if you want them to be eliminated, do you want them to show as a black and white photo or as an X? And also, um, yeah, let's see, can I, can I do this again without, um, okay, here we go. It looks different, I think. Yes, okay. The, it reset. Okay, so I'm not, it's not gonna have the same outcome as last time. Okay, here we go. <laughs> let's start. The bloodbath. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Zhang Haiyong scares Han Myung Oh away from the cornucopia. Shin Yu Sung runs away from the cornucopia. Yes, retribution, instant karma. Li Hyun Sung strangles Gong Pil Du with a rope. Thank you, Hyun Sung Ah. Thank you. Uh, Abysmal Black Flame Dragon runs away from the cornucopia. Persephone runs away from the cornucopia. Hades finds a backpack full of camping equipment. Ooh, good for him. Kim Dok Ja runs away from the cornucopia. Lee Sol Hua runs away from the cornucopia. Yu Jong Hyuk runs away from the cornucopia. Anna Croft runs away from the cornucopia. Han Su Young runs away from the cornucopia. Oldest Dream breaks Jung Hae Won's nose for a basket of bread. Oh my gosh, he really just threw hands with her. This tiny, ki this tiny kid 
really broke her nose for some bread. Damn. Bi Hyung grabs a sword. Oh my gosh, she has a sword. Secret of Plotter runs away from the cornucopia. Yuriel, Lee Gil Yong, and Lee Jae Hae work together to get as many supplies as possible. Yu Mia runs away from the cornucopia. Yu Sung Ah runs away from the cornucopia. And Kim Nam Woon scares Sun Wukong away from the cornucopia. Okay. This round is going a lot better than the last round already. Day one. The oldest dream makes a wooden spear. Hades diverts Kim Nam Woon's attention and runs away. Yu Mia scares Yu Sung Ah off. Yu Sung Ah off. I mean, I think she has her brother's uh, glare, so I could. She's probably really good at just staring and scaring, you know? Uh, Lee Hyun Sung tends to Anna Cross wounds. Han Su Yung, Perso Persephone, I'm so sorry, Persephone, Shin Yu Sung, and Yuriel hunt for other tributes. Jung Hae Wan, Zhang Ha Yong, and Lee Ji Hae hunt for other tributes. Yu Jung Hyuk, Lee Sol Hwa, and Lee Gil Yong hunt for other tributes. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon sprains his ankle while running away from Kim Dok Ja. Uh, Sun Wukong receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Secret of Plotter practices his archery. Bi Hyung and Han Meng Oh hunt for other tributes. Follow tributes 1. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance. Gong Pil Du District 9. Uh, deserved. Deserved. Okay. Night 1. Han Su Yong, Persephone, and Hades discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Ooh, st st strategizing. Kim Nam Woon cooks his food before putting his fire out. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon, Han Myung Oh, and Uriel discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Secret of Plotter and Lee Ji Hae huddle for warmth. <laughs> uh, I guess because Secret of Plotter has a big ass coat and he has his uh, his veil, so I guess it could keep them warm, kinda. Platonically, platonically, because Lee Ji Hae is his uh, apprentice. Sun Wukong, Lee Hyun Sung, Bi Hyung, and Yu Mia tell each other ghost stories to lighten the mood. <laughs> I could picture that Sun Wukong. Are, is really Sun Wukong is really good at telling ghost stories, I could imagine. And I can imagine that Lee Hyun Song uh, and Bi Hyung are really bad at it. And Yu Mia would be like really bored and disgusted by them. <laughs> uh, Zhang Ha Yong tries to sing herself to sleep. Oldest Dream severely injures Jung Hae Wan and leaves her to die. <gasps> First he broke her nose, now he injures her? Wow. He has like some vendetta against her. Shin Yu Sung lets Yu Jung Hyuk take. Wait, Shin Yu Sung lets Yu Jung Hyuk into her shelter. Oh, how nice of her. Lee Sol Hua questions her sanity. I think we would all be at this point. Kim Dok Ja fends Yu Sung Ah, Anna Croft, and Lee Gil Yong away from his fire. <laughs> I can just imagine Kim Dok Ja with like a stick. And he's like with his arms out waving them. It's like, no, sorry guys, this is mine, my fire. Okay, day two. They would beat him up, by the way. He would. They would beat him up and steal his fire. It would be really easy for them. Uh, day two. Persephone, Lee Sol Hua, Lee Hyun Sung, and Abysmal Black Flame Dragon raid Sun Wukong's camp while he is hunting. Zhang Ha Yong receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Ooh. Yu Mia receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Lee Gil Yong tries to spear fish with a trident. Yu Sung Ah practices her archery. Kim Dok Ja receives an explosive from, from an unknown sponsor. <laughs> Maybe from uh, the. Uh, Maybe from the secret of Plotter, he wants to kind of curry favor with him. Uh, Lee, uh, Lee Ji Hae tries to sleep through the entire day. Hades steals from Uriel while she isn't looking. Kim Nam Moon tends to Yu Jung Hyuk's wounds. Ooh. Anna Croft tries to spear fish with the trident. Shin Yu Sung explores the arena. Han Su Yoon tries to spear fish with the trident. Bi Hyung practices his archery. Han Myung Oh runs away from the secret of Plotter. And oh, oldest dream her injures himself. Oh, poor baby. Okay. Fallen tributes two. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance. Jung Haewon, District 5. Left to die by the oldest dream. Night 2. Lee Sol Hua attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Jung Haeyong thinks about home. Aw. Lee Hyun Sung attempts to start a fire, but is also unsuccessful. Anna Croft and the Secret of Plotter sleep in shifts. I know they can't, definitely can't trust each other, so they better keep one eye. I, I'd be surprised if they were sleeping near each other. Han Su Yong defeats Abyssal Black Flame Dragon in a fight, but spares his life. Um, because he's her sponsor, and he, and uh, she really shouldn't kill her sponsor. Kim Nam Moon climbs up a tree to rest. Uh, Persephone destroys all the stream supplies while he's asleep. Oh gosh, Lee Ji Hae goes to sleep. 
Bi Hyung sets up a camp for the night. Uh, Hades tends to sun Wukong's wounds. Yu Jung Hyuk attempts to start a fire but is unsuccessful. <laughs> Shin Yu Sung, Yu Mia, and Han Myung Oh discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Lee Gil Yong, Yuriel, and Kim Dok Ja sleep in shifts. Okay, they can be more trusted. Oh no! Yu Sung Ah dies of dysentery. Dis oh no! Day 3. Han Myung Oh steals from Shin Yu Sung while she isn't looking. Terrible grown up. Kim Na Moon, Yu Jung Hyuk, and Han Soo Young hunt for other tributes. Yu Mia defeats Bi Hyung in a fight but spares his life. The oldest dream is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Oh no! Kim Dok Ja goes hunting. Lee Gil Yong, Secret of Plotter, Lee Sol Hua, and Anna Croft raid Lee Hyun Song's camp while he is hunting. <laughs> Persephone, Yuriel, and Lee Ji Hae get into a fight. Yuriel triumphantly kills them both. Oh, wow. Wow, no no mercy from the, uh, uh the, uh, no mercy from this devilish angel. Jan ha -yong, Jang ha -yong makes a slingshot. Uh, oh. Ha Hades is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Sun Wukong dies. Wait, no, he does not die, sorry. Sun Wukong diverts abysmal black flame dragon's attention and runs away. Fallen Tributes 3. Three cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Yu Sung Ah, Persephone, and Lee Ji Hae. Aw, all these strong, independent women. Okay. Night 3. Hades and Jiang Ha Yong huddle for warmth. <clears throat> you have a wife, sir? Lee Hyun Sung climbs a tree to rest. Anna Croft, Yu Jung Hyuk, and Shin Yu Song cheerfully sing songs together. <laughs> Uh, we can definitely assume that it was not Yu Jung Hyuk's idea. Oldest Dream tends to Bi Hong's wounds. Kim Na Moon and Sun, Yu Sun Wukong huddle for warmth. Lee Gil Yong sets up a camp for the night. Secret of Plotter taints Yu Mia's food, killing her. Didn't he kill her in the last in the last round too? You're killing your sister. Han Myung Oh begs for Han Su Yong uh, to kill him. She reluctantly obliges and kills Han Young Oh. Wow. Kim Jok Ja quietly hums. Yuriel tends to abyssal black flame dragon's wounds. Lee Sol Hua cooks her food before putting her fire out. Day four. Wow, Kim Dok Ja uh, made it a lot farther this time. Okay. For now, fingers crossed. Day four. Lee Sol Hua and abyssal black flame dragon hunt for other tributes. Lee Gil Yong attacks Yu Jong Hyuk, but he manages to escape. Kim Na Moon discovers a river. Ooh, water. Han Soo Young searches for a water source. Bi, Bi Hyung, Oldest Dream, and Sun Wukong hunt for other tributes. Shin Yu Sung chases Anna Croft. Zhang Ha Young camouflages herself in the bushes. Lee Hyun Sung steals from Uriel while she isn't looking. I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do to survive, huh? Kim Dok Ja fishes. Secret of Plotter explores the arena. Fallen Tributes 4. Two cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Yu Mia and Han Myung Oh. Night 4. Sun Wukong cooks his food before putting his fire out. Kim Dok Ja receives another explosive from an unknown sponsor. Jan Ha Yong climbs a tree to rest. Secret of Plotter also receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Ooh. Shin Yu Song sets an explosive off. Killing, oh no, killing Yu Jo Hyuk, Lee Gil Yong, Bi Hyuk, and Kim Na Moon. No! Abyssal Black Flame Dragon convinces Lee Sol Hua to, to snuggle with him. Ooh, ooh, this guy. No, bad. Bad touch. No. Uriel is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Oldest Dream receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Han Su Yong thinks about home. Anna Croft cooks her food before putting her fire out. Hades and Lee Hyun Sung huddle for warmth. Day 5. <gasps> Uriel dies from hunger. Oh no. Kim Dok Ja is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Oh no! Lee Hyun Sung kills Oldest Dream with a sickle! Anna Croft constructs a shack. Han Su Yong overhears Hayes and Jang Ha Yong talking in the distance. Secret of Plotter practices his archery. Sun Wukong explores the arena. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon tries to spear fish with a trident. Lee Sol Hua stalks Shin Yu Song. Fallen Tributes 5. Six, si wow. Six cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Rip, Yu Jong Hyuk, Lee Gil Yong, Bi Hyung, Kim Na Moon, Yuriel, and Oldest Dream 
Come on! Kim Dok Cha, you got this! Secret of Night 5. Secret of Plotter thinks about home. Lee Hyun Sung, Anna Croft, and Shin Yu Sung discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Han Soo Young kills Abyssal Black Flame Dragon as he tries to run. Oh, she kills her sponsor this time. Sun Wukong thinks about winning. Kim Dok Cha cries himself to sleep. Oh, my heart! Hades shoots an arrow at Lee Sol Hwa, but misses and kills Jang Ha Young instead. Oof. Okay. The Feast. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and, mem and memoirs of the tribute from the tribute families. Sun Wukong, the secret of plotter, gets into a fight over raw meat. The secret of plotter gives up and runs away. Shin Yu Song kills Lee Sol Hwa with a sickle. Kim Dok Ja and Han Soo Young decide to work together to get more supplies. Yeah. The duo from the trio. <laughs> the Han Yu Kim trio. Lee Hyun Sung and Hades decide to work together to get more supplies. Anna Croft accidentally steps on a landmine. Oof. Oof. Day 6. Kim Dok Ja tends to Shin Yu Sung's wounds. Secret of Plotter overhears Sun Wukong and Han Yu Sung talking in the distance. Lee Hyun Sung bleeds out due to untreated injuries. Oh, Hyun Sung. -a. Hades hunts for other tributes. We're getting down to the wire, guys. Fallen Tribute 6. Five cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Abyssal Black Flame Dragon, Jan Ha Yong, Lee Sol Hwa, Anna Croft, and Lee Hyun Sung. Okay, Night 6. Sun Wukong destroys Hades' supplies while he is asleep. Kim Dok Ja starts a fire. Secret of Plotter passes out from exhaustion. Shin Yu Song climbs a tree to rest. Han Su Yong receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Ooh. Okay. Day 7. Kim Dok Ja stalks Hades. Shin Yu Song receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Se Secret of Plotter receives an explosive from an unknown spotter. A, a sponsor. Unknown sponsor. Han Su Yong defeats Sun Wukong in a fight but spares his life. Fallen Tribute 7. No cannon shots can be heard in the distance. No one was killed um, this night. Uh, this day. Night 7. Sun Wukong receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Han Su Yong attempts to start a fire but is unsuccessful. Shin Yu Sung begs for Hayes to kill her. He refuses, keeping Shin Yu Sung alive. Kim Dok Ja sets up camp for the night. <gasps> Secret of Plotter dies from hunger. Oh no! Day 8. Shin Yu Sung and Sun Wukong split up to search for resources. Kim Dok Ja sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Hades scares Han Su Young off. Fallen Tributes 8. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance. Secret of Plotter. Oh no! Kim Dok Ja! Night 8. Sun Wukong, Han Su Young, and Kim Dok Ja start fighting, but Han Su Young runs away as Sun Wukong kills Kim Dok Ja. Oh no, I was really rooting for you, but you know, at least you made it a lot farther than you did in the first round. Uh, Shin Yu Sung is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Hades cooks his food before putting his fire out. Day 9. Shin Yu Sung chases Han Su Young. Hades repeatedly stabs Sun Wukong to death with size. Ooh, wow. Fallen Tributes 9. Two cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Kim Dok Ja and Sun Wukong, who killed Kim Dok Ja, so uh, instant karma retribution. Night 9. Oh no! Shin Yu Sung unknowingly eats toxic berries. Han Su Yung shoots a poisonous blow dart into Hayes' neck, slowly killing him. The winner! The winner is Han Su Yung from District 3! Okay, you know, I'm... I'm not mad about that, okay? I'm not mad about that. Placements. At least one of the Han Yu Kim trio won. You know, one of the main characters, the author. Oh, isn't it kind of uh, interesting that the author... Uh, uh, of Ways of Survival won the Hunger Games um, for Omniscient Reader. The author came out at the top in the end. Good for her. Placement. Han Su Young is the winner, followed by Hades in second place, and Shin Yu Sung in third place. And then everyone else is a loser. No, I'm kidding. Everyone else did the best they could, except for Gong Pildu. <clears throat> the summary. The bloodbath. Lee Hyun Sung strangles Gong Pildu with a rope. Day one. No deaths occurred. Night 1, Oldest Dream severely injures Jung Hae Won and leaves her to die. Day 2, no deaths occurred. Night 2, Yu Sung Ah dies from dysentery. Day 3, Persephone, Uriel, and Lee Jae Hae get into a fight. Uriel triumphantly kills them both. Night 3, Secret of Plotter taints Yumiya's food, killing her.
Han Myung Oh begs for Han Su Yun to kill him. She reluctantly obliges, killing Han Myung Oh. Day 4, no deaths occurred. Night 4, Shin Yu Sung sets an explosive off, killing Yoo Jung Hyuk, Lee Gil Yong, Bi Hyung, and Kim Nam Woon. Day 5, Yuriel dies from hunger. Lee Hyun Sung kills Oldest Dream with a sickle. Night 5, Han Su Yun kills Abyssal Black Flame Dragon as he tries to run. Hades shoots an arrow at Lee Sol Hwa, but misses and kills Zhang Ha Yong instead. The Feast, Shin Yu Sung kills Lee Sol Hwa with a sickle. Anna Croft accidentally steps on a landmine. Day 6, Lee Hyun Sung bleeds out due to untreated injuries. Night 6, no deaths occurred. Day 7, no deaths occurred. Night 7, Secretive Plotter dies from hunger. Death 8, no deaths occurred. Oh, Day 8, no deaths occurred. Night 8, Sun Wukong, Han Su Yung, and Kim Dok Ja start fighting, but Han Su Yung runs away as Sun Wukong kills Kim Dok Ja. Day 9, Haiti, Haiti repeatedly stabs Sun Wukong to death with Sai. I don't know what that is, Sai? Night 9, Shin Yu Sung unknowingly eats toxic berries. Han Su Yung shoots a poisonous blow dart into Haiti's neck, slowly killing him. The winner is Han Su Yung from District 3. Okay, so here are the statistics. The placements. Han Su Yung uh, is first, and Gong Pil Du is last. Uh, district placements. District 3 is first, District 7 is last. And Shin Yu Sung has the most kills with 5. Wow. Wow, little lady. That's a lot of deaths, a lot of murders. And Oldest Dream, Sacred Plotter, and Sun Wukong are tied with one kill. Okay, that's it. Uh, we are done with the Hunger Games uh, Simulator Omniscient Reader's Viewpoint Edition. What did you guys think? Normally, I would only do one round because it does take a while to go through the simulator, but I could not accept the results from the first round. I don't, I don't actually dislike Gong Pil Du. I just like... I just, he was kind of like, not my favorite character and kind of slimy and self-serving. So like, he only kind of redeemed himself later on in the novel, but especially early on in the novel, he just really cared for himself and was kind of ruthless. So I, I really didn't want him to win in the Hunger Games simulator when there's a lot of other characters that deserve to win more, which is why I did a second round of the simulation. This time, Han Su Yung won, our girl, the author, the writer, yeah. So. What did you guys think of the results? Um, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!